The Lady Tigers improved their record to 18 and 6 after Sunday's doubleheader at Tiger Park. LSU faced off with Louisiana Tech first. Pitcher Shelby Wickersham started out a little shaky but quickly got her footing, bagging six strikeouts and allowing only three hits. Left fielder Allie Newland also played stellar defense with a diving catch that turned into a double play and saved two runs from scoring. Yeah, I, I told Taylor Pleasance that was all her. I just getting to listen to her. As soon as I popped up, she was like, two, two, two. So like knowing she has my back and telling me where to go is just huge in the whole thing. The team racked up 12 hits, including a home run for Morgan Cummins in the bottom of the fourth inning. Cummins also had a double and Taylor Taylor Pleasance went two for two with a double and two RBIs. The Tigers run ruled Tech in the sixth inning, eight to zero. Just 35 minutes later, the team started their second game of the day against Central Connecticut with Ray Lynn Chafin on the mound. Chafin finished with a career high of 12 strikeouts. Much like the first game, the team gave a solid performance, collecting nine hits and allowing only three opposing hits. Bailey Brandon put the first runs on the board with a two run bomb in the bottom of the second and Newland followed suit with her own home run in the bottom of the fifth. The Tigers won 5-0, to zero, and after a long weekend, are ready to rest up for SEC play. We have a full week where we can just kind of be our best version of ourselves. We can go back to the drawing board, get some things right that we need to with our own selves, and then spend some time preparing for Alabama, which is a tall task. The Tigers will face the undefeated Crimson Tide on Friday at Tiger Park. For Tiger TV Sports, I'm Abby Alonzo.